What was I thinking? It wasn't. A minute ago when I'm dead, he look at me, lads. Whipping the car, taking it for a spin. Dare me to do something else, put the foot down. Right. Had her up to 90. Pushing for 95, daft at Limport, no handling. <laughs> Clipped that lamppost. I would have made it in a quattro. I never would have been caught in a quattro. Why did I listen to him? Laughing like hyenas in the back. Cackling, faster, Jano, go faster. Could blame the drink. Got off me head, so he was. But it was my hands on the wheel. My feet on the pedal. On the floor. And somebody calls the cops because there's a ding in the street light at three in the bleeding morning. I'm sure the cops had nothing better to do. So they do me. I mean, I'd have kept on going, raced them, kept up the gas, foot down till sun up, you know. <laughs> but then I hit something. Polly says it was a cat, or maybe a fox or a dog, or I don't know. It, it felt bigger. It was like a jolt of caffeine to the veins, thump, wide awake, aware, holding that wheel, the boys laughing in the back. The split second a pair of eyes looked right through me. Then they were gone. Thump. Told me ma I'd finished the apprenticeship. And me da, <laughs> sure he was right. I hate him for it. Knew I wouldn't follow through. He didn't even look at me after the coppers rang him. Not in the station, nor the cell, or the courts. I was wrong. I don't pretend what I'd done was right, but... <sighs> a cat? So the car was rubbish anyway, and the lamppost was old. And and here I am, lying on me back in this hole. But what if it wasn't a cat? Or a fox, or a dog? What if... What if it was...